what Angeline allows me to do is, is, is to introduce um, a singer-songwriter called John Martin, who wrote many beautiful songs, uh, one of which was called Angeline. And uh, it, it is, it's a beautiful lament, and I guess it's a, a lament for, for lost love. And I've taken the title, and, I, and I've kind of changed it slightly. And uh, the image really is about lost innocence. One of the lines in the, in the lyric for, for Angeline is, Angeline, will you always wear white? And, and unfortunately, the human condition being what it is, the answer is an emphatic no. And I often think that one of the saddest aspects of this life for, for a chap is to come to terms with the fact that, I hesitate to say this, but, but, but women are not always as lovely as they are packaged. But anyway, that aside, it, it's, it's about lost innocence and it's about the acquaintance that we must all make slowly, eventually, with this world. The background is uh, is a deserted and much destroyed uh, hotel in in a, in a hill town in Cambodia called uh, Kampot. The 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 vulture was photographed on on a glorious day uh, in the UK, which I spent almost the whole of it in an aviary full of vultures, which was a fabulous experience. They really are beautiful birds. And uh, the snake was photographed in a snake farm in Thailand. And, and the girl, uh, who was a daughter of a friend of mine, and the little piece of glass, which she's about to step on, were photographed in the studio. Actually, that's not her hair, interestingly. Because she had dark hair, it didn't work coming out of the darkish background so well. So I, uh, I, I put on there some hair, which I believe, if I remember rightly, was, was from a doll, believe it or nay. So that is Angeline, which is my lament for lost innocence.